All right, Meek Mill shares his thoughts on O3 Greedo not being able to drop music. O3 said, I want to drop 30 songs a month like my idols did, but the industry won't allow. Let's fix this. Meek said, this is what everybody trying to do in the industry. Got to block on when you can release music so you won't f*** all these weak-ass major releases they spend money on. Now, just imagine if all artists <laughs> was dropping 30 songs a month. Hell no. Yeah. Too many artists for that. Like, at, at some point, you got to be realistic. Yeah. Oh, three can we, do it. Listen, you can do it alone. It's but, absurd. But we're not trying to hear every artist under the sun that rap dropping 30 songs a month. Yeah. No. We already got dropping 15, 15 songs a month albums. How many albums drop every Friday? Too many. You know what I'm saying? Can't, like, keep, God, up with can't keep up with the music. Yeah, you can't. It's too hard to keep up with all these artists that's out right now. It's like, God damn. And it's a lot of nice ones that's out, but it's too hard to keep up with all that shit. That's thirty right. songs that I, like Greedo, yeah, that would be dope. That would Greedo be, could do that. That would be his thing. He will actually do that. Though. But the problem is with that is everybody's gonna try to mimic that for sure. And that's when it's gonna become like, all right. You feel like I feel like everybody can't make that much music. Shit, niggas gonna think they can. Niggas should be trash. Ask AD thirty songs and not even a year. Niggas should be trash. Hey, niggas gonna, no motto. It's gonna if O three start doing that shit, somebody gonna be like. I'm about to top it. I'm going to make 60. Yeah, no. You know how niggas no. is. Hell no. Is I'm there a... anybody you would want to hear 60 songs from in a, in a month? No. Ain't? I don't want to hear. What if it was Drake? Nope. Six nope. songs from a nigga. I'm not trying to hear 60 songs. No. no. Even when motherfuckers drop their albums and they got 30 songs on the album, I be like. I don't even like when people uh, do the deluxes. I, don't even I hate I think the deluxes. The last person that I, like, <laughs> I actually tried to listen to over 20 songs CB it was, was Chris me. Brown. Yeah. And I was like. He got some bangers on here, but, but like, it's excessive. It's too many songs. It's Thirty bro. songs is That's a lot. That's too much. That's excessive. I'm That's like, a lot. I'm like, it's overkill. You don't need that many songs, bro. Like, it's overkill at the you end. Don't, even like, twenty be pushing it sometimes. I feel like deluxes be pushing it. No, deluxe is cool because you got time to take everything in, and then you let, a little later you got. The next they'll month. put four, like four or five new songs. You've already digested the album up and down. You gonna get them four or five new songs and shit. Cool, that's good. Some of them songs could stay off. I ain't gonna lie, a lot of to me, a lot of them deluxe songs be dope. You like them? Yeah. Mm. I, don't, I don't. I can't go back and listen to everybody fucking album, and then they listen to their deluxe on top yeah, of that. Yeah, like, I can't do. If that. you a fan of somebody's music and they drop four new songs, yeah, five new a songs, fan of somebody's music, not all yes, these not goddamn artists. And it was yeah, I you feel like saying? it was a time where everybody was trying to drop a fucking deluxe. Everybody still do. People yeah, still do that. That shit. Is too they still drop deluxes. That's yeah, because it still that. counts on the same album too. That's all day. You know what I'm saying? Just be weak. I mean, shit. Be? Everybody music ain't gonna be for you. Everybody music ain't gonna be for me. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's it's a lot of dope little motherfuckers out there, but the the, the, the problem is, is music so disposable now, man. Like, shit used to last for a year, two years. Now songs last three months. Barely. And then you move on to the next one. Not even three months. That's what I'm saying. Barely. Motherfucker be over shit. What y'all? What's, what's y'all thoughts as a female? What's y'all thoughts on girl rap right now? With like they're dominating, obviously, right? But are the songs like are they gonna are they gonna be here in five years? Like are we gonna go back and listen to them and still love them? No, or are not these all just, of like, them. Pop, a few of them will. Are these just popcorn records? Um, I feel like a lot of them are popcorn. It's a good question. A lot of them are popcorn, but some of them will last. Like, like, like I okay, like, say say the song. I feel like tomorrow too gonna last a long time. So you think in five years that's still gonna have a song? I feel like tomorrow too. That's Glorilla Cardi and Glorilla. I think that's gonna. Crash. I think F and F would last for sure. Yeah, like fuck nigga freeze gonna. That's a that's a time in a club period. I think people really love tomorrow too. Um, you think, and girls is players too. That's gonna yeah. stay five years from now. I nah. <clears throat> that's high in the Billboard charts right now too. Yeah, because it's just catchy. High. Like no. I don't think a lot of females could. Like, I ain't gonna lie, they dominating right now though. Mm-hmm. But like, I feel I like, but the rappers. city girls ain't did shit. I mean, it, it's shit. Look you how many me? girls it is now. They got classic though. That yeah, that's big. They, they do. They, they do. play that shit still. Every so, that's club. what I'm saying. Certain, certain females, certain females, now. certain females, certain songs. Yeah, certain ones. No. It just depends on if they put the hit out or not. Yeah, I'm just like, damn, man, so many girl rappers, and I'm like, it's, it's fire it's to the point, It's to the point where. Like I heard a record today on the radio, and it was a girl that sound exactly like Ice Spice, bro. Really? Same style, beat selection, like, and the song was on the radio. I was like, "This is crazy." You didn't even like let Ice Spice like B 
become who Damn, she, I need to hear the song. Like, I you, fuck with you stole her style already. It's early, too. I fuck with You know people going to do that. Like, you already took her style. <laughs> a label already. Everything yeah, working, people going to replicate it. A label already done took it and put it on the radio. Like, I got to hear it. Damn, this bitch sound dead ass like Ice Spice. It's a song I heard that was a little catchy. Same type of cadence, delivery, all that shit. It's like, damn. That That's shit crazy. crazy. That's just, I don't know, man. I spice at her own mode, though. She doing her thing. Doing you her can't shit. take nothing away from her. She doing her thing. Shout out to Ice Spice, man. That song with her and Nikki go up. That song that with her and the, uh, the, the liar song. The gun the boys are liar. Her, shit, shit. Her, her in her mood, that shit fire. Yeah, her own shit. Yeah. She got she having a little. I fuck with her. Nice you know what's crazy? I was actually listening to some of her singles today before she actually got popping. And she has she was saying some shit. Like, I really fuck with you her. Fuck with it? Yeah, I fuck with her. Cool. I mean, before she, she got popping, she was doing like that trap shit. Yeah. You know what I'm but I mean, I like trap shit. All right, let's move on. Oh, you like trap? Yeah. Oh, you be doing a little dance and shit. 